Oh, hello, Mr. Charles. Good morning. Yeah, my night was great and yours. Yeah, everyone is fine over here. How's your family as well? And I hope Madame is doing a pretty good job taking good care of you. <laughs> of course, my friend, of course. You know, we are blessed with the best wives. Now, how can I forget? You know how I'm into all that. My ambition hasn't changed a bit ever since then. I just needed a little bit of... of um, encouragement. Yeah, Mr. Charles, I will have to call you back on this subject. We'll talk later, okay? All right, thank you. Baby, pause now. Nah, it's a slow one. It's, no one. it's just an old friend of mine. Sure? Yeah. Tell me the truth. What was that? Yeah, I said a good friend of mine. We've been married for the past nine years now. And I know you too well. Whenever you don't want to tell me anything. Or are you cheating on me? Uh uh. How would I be cheating on you? Why would I do something mm, like that? Mm. So, so you got me. I was actually on the phone with Mr. Charles. Do you remember Mr. Charles? Mm. Um, we bumped into each other yesterday. Is it spin No, I'm not So, okay. we had a nice time catching up and all that because it's been such a while, you know? So, he was reminding me of fearless zeal and ambition of running for president. Baby, come on. You know how much I desire to stay away from politics. Each time I encounter my father and I. Well, not my father. Well, I don't see any difference. Michelle. What? Why do you want to be president, Tell me. Because you want to be famous? You want to be rich? Because you want to acquire power? Tell me why. None of those. Then what? You want to save the world? Of the millions that are falling for this country, how many has truly been celebrated as yours? Tell me, how many? I'm not seeking to be a hero. Then what? A matter? Your father was betrayed to his death by his boss of due to this same politics. You said this to me yourself, remember? And now you I'm, are telling me... You didn't get the irony of the story I told. It was my father who betrayed his friend to death. What? This is what I was trying to do. My father was a good man. He will never hurt to fly. After the incident of his friend's death, I woke up each morning unsure of myself. But I had to brace up and tell myself that I'm not my father. I'm not perfect. I'll never be. But I'm resolved not to walk his path. You asked why I want to be president. Well, I'm not sure if being president is what I want. I just know that I want to be free. I want to see you free. And Muna. I want a better life for our baby and generation. And that will never happen with these men in power. We don't have all the needs here. But we are not starving. We are fine. Maybe today. Who knows what they have in stock for us for tomorrow? I've always cherished the simplicity and the privacy of our lives. Why do you want to take that away from us? Politics isn't bad as it seems. It's the players that make the game what it seems. Without your consent, I won't go on with this. 
But I believe you always knew this day will come. 